Hi, this is Stephanie. I'd like to welcome you to my Google business profile. Do you need advertising on YouTube? Uh, feel free to connect with me. I create YouTube videos, video marketing services. So if you need advertisement on our videos, we do that at an affordable rate. I will make the video for your business and I will post it on my YouTube channel. I will basically run an ad, run a commercial um, to one of my videos that I share on YouTube. So if you're interested in that, I'm located in the Metro Atlanta area. I normally serve the Atlanta market as well as throughout the US. So if you need a video ad for your business, check out my Google profile. You'll see my portfolio. You'll see my work. Um, you'll see the videos that I've created where I've promoted other companies. And thank you for visiting my profile. If you have any questions, visit my website. You can reach me on my website for more information. I want to thank you for coming by. You have a great day. Bye-bye. Hey guys, it's Melissa K, and I'm back with another cooking video. So today, um, I'm going to make a meatless panea pasta dish. It is um, the organic brown rice in quinoa pasta. Um, so it's not your traditional white pasta. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. Guys, I just put a um, water on. Um, it's been on for about 10 minutes and it started boiling. So now what I'm going to do is go ahead and add that panea pasta in there. All right, guys, so I just measured out a quarter teaspoon of salt. I'm just gonna sprinkle that in there. All right, so I'm pouring, this is my second bag. I'm making two bags of this. All right, and I'm gonna leave it on for about 15 minutes or until soft. Sometimes I take it off a little bit before, but the package says seven to 10 minutes. But because I'm using two packs, I might just keep it on a few minutes longer. All right, I gotta stir it up, so make sure it's under that water. All right, so I'm gonna let that, um, go ahead and put my timer on or my watch, which is my watchful eye. <laughs> All right, we'll be back in 10 to 15 minutes to check. Okay, so I'm going to saute some vegetables that I'm gonna use in the, in the sauce. All right, so I have red onions, garlic, habanero or a scotch bonnet pepper, tomatoes, green and red peppers, and thyme, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the pot. I'm stir frying it in grapeseed oil. Okay, so I just added in the seasoning. I'm just, just kind of lightly stir frying it. It smells really good. Um, I actually added some allspice and also known as um, pimento. <coughs> and um, I crushed it up, so I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm gonna stir fry this for a few minutes. All right guys, so now I'm actually, I already drained it. It was in there for a little less than 10 minutes. I feel like it overcooked a little bit because it's kind of soft. Um, so I'm rinsing it with cold water. The cold water helps to firm it back up a little bit. But it is it did overcook a little bit. It wasn't that I left it on long. It was just that I had the water boiling probably for a few minutes um, before I actually poured it in. And when you do that, the water sometimes with these um, different type of pastas where it's made out of like brown rice and quinoa. They tend to cook really, they're very sensitive to overcooking. So um, I rinsed it out a little bit just before I put the camera on, but I'm going hard body now. And 
I'm gonna let that drain for a little while and we're gonna work on the sauce. Hi everybody, it's your lady Steph, but I'd like to welcome you to our YouTube channel called What's Your Matter? So on our channel, we share relevant content related to health and wellness. We also share reviews, gardening tips, you know, gardening videos, vlogs, and business content. So here's the thing. We have an online shop. The name of our online shop is called Afri Newbie, and we have a combination of things now. We have mugs, t-shirts, men's, men's shirts, women's shirts, hoodies. We have notebooks. We have phone cases. We have, we have towels, pillows, you know, the list just goes on and on. So if you like our channel and you want to support us, feel free to, you know, get some products. You could get some merch. It's all about us giving back to the online community in a positive way. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of, you know, negative content online. So we're just here to share experiences and things of that nature that will change your life. So what I'm going to do in the next clip, I'm going to let you see our merch. Thank you for your support. All right, so I just put in this tomato and basil pasta sauce. I added this tomato sauce just to give it a little extra. A little bit of ketchup. Two tablespoons of coconut sugar. Two tablespoons of coconut flour. And the thyme. All right, so I'm gonna let it simmer down just for a few minutes, and then I'll be adding the pasta to it. Okay. Okay, so I sprinkled dairy-free cheddar, cheddar style cheese and mozzarella style cheese on top of the pasta. I also mixed the pasta. I'm gonna show you guys what that pasta is looking like. I can show you better than I can explain it. But basically I got it on 350 and I got the pasta baking. I had some other vegan cheese that was pretty much ready to be used. It was in the fridge for a while, so I went ahead and put that in there. So I'm gonna let this stay in here for probably a good 15 minutes.